Alpha Domenici is an American company which was founded back in Utah in 2012. We made the steampunk to really make the best cup of coffee in a really beautiful way in a commercial environment. We really wanted to distill that down to something that you can use at home super simply and it's much easier to clean. The flask is a full immersion brewer. Um, it's really similar to a French press, but it makes a much cleaner cup. When we design a new product, it doesn't matter whether it's a commercial product or whether it's a product for home. We believe in three core values of that product. It has to be beautifully designed. Aesthetics is very important for us. It has to deliver a perfect cup every single time. And it has to be sustainable in a way that we're using our materials. And we believe as well that design in itself is a sustainable factor because the more beautiful the product is, the longer you will use it. We believe that the flask is a perfect extension of our core values. We wanted to bring the, that beauty of brewing and, and make a really good cup of coffee really simple uh, to make at home. So that's why we made the flask and uh, it really makes an extraordinary cup of coffee at home super easy.
So this is uh, the bulb that has actually been up to space and passed the drop test from 100,000 feet back to Earth. The world is switching to LED, uh, but LEDs are kind of pretty horrible at the moment. Doing products with light bulbs, we've experienced and noticed that the light that we want is not really what we can find in the market. Lighting has a really big role in how we feel, and recreating this filament with this new design that sort of characterizes fire, at the same time creates something that is also energy efficient. And that's really where the idea of ARC came out. Before we started flights, we used to send things up into space. Now that we've got into making crazy levitating light bulbs, we thought we, we want to send something from flight up into space. The idea of nature and lightness, and it kind of fit perfectly with the idea of our launch. So we went uh, in the middle of nowhere uh, in one of the darkest days of the year. It's freezing here. It's one of the coldest and darkest places to be. We're going to set a light bulb free by putting it on a near space balloon. We've done a few film shoots here at Flight and we have never done anything where you spend weeks preparing. But as soon as you let go, you can't do anything. A lot of preparation is necessary. Timing is critical. It's about 95% planning and 5% execution. Every little angle of the cameras, every little sensor, everything has to be perfect. There is no adjustment afterwards. We managed to pull it off. Then we had the challenge of actually finding it. And after three or four hours, we didn't get any communication from our rig. We had a, a problem with the GPS transponder. Uh, we think it's because of the extreme cold. It's minus 60 up there. That's when our team sort of gave up on the idea of ever recovering it again. But the next day, we got a call from a local ice fisherman. An ice fisherman found it the next morning in the middle of nowhere. So it was a really nice, interesting mix of randomness and human kindness that brought this whole project together. We all know the advantages of having LED lights. It's in our homes, in our offices, everywhere. But the thing is that with this advancement, we forgot about one important factor, is that LEDs, to be appreciated, they must also look nice. We want to make an affordable version, one that can hang in bars and cafes and homes all around the world. Our LEDs last 30,000 light hours, so that's 14 years, uh, six hours a day. So if they're gonna be lasting a long time, they might as well look really nice. We're working with one of the best manufacturers in the world, but nevertheless, we still need your help. With your support on this journey, we could really bring this product to life and set the light bulb free. So this is the actual light bulb that's been up to space. As much as we'd love to keep it, we do plan on letting one lucky backer take it home. So if you're into the idea of having something in your home or business that has been into the stratosphere, this might be the pledge level for you. Thank you.